Hello everyone and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. How are you all doing today? Hope cool. So in case if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do so. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you. So guys, in today's gist, hmm, a renowned uh, Ifa priest and an elder has reached out to the only of Ife. He has reached out to the entire people, uh, revealing the reasons why only of Ife has been getting married to so many wives and uh, so many of them have been leaving the palace of Ilefe kingdom. So guys, this man revealed that if Kia is not taking that many more wives are going to leave the palace and, uh, and only of Ife is going to get married to many more wives as well, okay? That's all these ones that are there, that are there is not that they still want to stay there, but they're just there for uh, stay sick so that people will not, will not say oh you put that rush into the marriage why are you put rushing out again that so many of them are there not because they want to be there but because of what people will say and how people are going to feel or how, what people are going to say about them that is the reason why they are still there that there are so many ways only of if uh, should have taken to get married to these six wives and uh, it won't be a problem and even the ones that left him before that if he had taken the right way if he had has done it the proper way that all his alluries uh they wouldn't have in fact for no reason they won't leave the palace of Elefi kingdom okay so guys uh, this man uh, revealed a whole lot of things saying that only of if he married the six wives uh, uh out of modernity and every other thing that he shouldn't allow modernity to detect who to marry and uh, when to marry that person. That when you look at the six wives he's married, now you find out that only of if he did not consult the Ifa priest. So this man went as far as saying that uh, that, that everybody should forget about uh, um, all this saying that if a priest choose this, if a priest choose this one to be on his, on his wife and every other thing. That all these six wives, that they just cajole themselves into the palace, they maneuver the processes, they maneuver the procedures and get into the palace. They bought the uh, throne, the queenship throne with their money. That not no oracle was consulted before they came into the palace. That truly that if a priest advised that the throne was never meant for an uh, for only one olori okay so that the throne needed many oloris to stay there so that they are not going to be dragging the throne of elefe so but uh, the case of coming out to say that it is the if a priest that uh choose the six wives that all more <laughs> that's all if a priest did not choose the six wives uh that that is just a mere story to confuse the entire public that only of if you choose them out of modernity oh look at my wife she's the doctor of this oh look at my wife she has a phd degree oh look at my wife she's going out she's flying abroad and coming back oh look at my wife this and that that was the reason why he got married to women of such timber and caliber because you know this sex wife that he got married to hey hey oh hey, more they get money now more waiting they won't take only money do again so this man has come out to say that the reason why only of if he got married to them was just because of their money and nothing else okay so this man revealed saying that if Kia is not taken that so many of them might as well leave the palace of Elefi kingdom okay that only of if he didn't consult the Efa priest and uh, that he wouldn't call it a disease but huh, that's something that that the, the palace needs a deliverance and only of if he also needs to work on his uh, self somehow where women matter they that if all these things are not done that <laughs> that more mistakes are going to occur in the palace of Ilefi kingdom okay so this man revealed that the this uh divorce of a teen, uh will only make the throne so open for so many people to be talking about it yeah when that was when he was asked if uh, uh the uh, the women living the palace as in this series of divorce and every other thing if he has uh, any negative any negative effect on the throne so this man revealed that it doesn't have any negative effect on the throne but it will make so many people to start talking about the palace anyhow any in fact so many people so many tongues will be working concerning the palace and when you look at it today i think that's what is happening because this divorce of 18 especially this period that he's divorced uh queen uh that queen now michelle can only left the palace it left so many tongues wagging so many people we are complaining and when you look at it right now when you search on the internet when you in fact when you solve the internet so well you find out that uh in life a kingdom almost i think is a 
top 10 talk there about is among the top 10 uh um this thing gist and saga that uh, every day you come online to hear about it yeah people talk about it so well right now but had it been that all these things we didn't hear it or something like that that queen naomi didn't leave the palace in fact only would have been doing his things gently and everything without anybody disturbing him so even before the bloggers started carrying so many news about the palace of Ilefe kingdom they know so well that all these divorce series of divorce will make so many tongues wagging concerning the palace that is why some people will tell you, oh, they're not doing anything. And they're... in fact, they know. Yeah, they know that they opened the door. You know, now they say that. And now they say that uh, him who fetched an ant infested firewood should be ready, uh, has, uh, should be ready to dance the dance of what? Because he has called, no. Yeah, because he has called the lizard to feast and be what? So that is what is happening right now. So he also went ahead to address the parents of the couples. That is uh, only of Ife's parents and uh, King Naomi's parents, saying that um, their marriage. In fact, not only he didn't advise only Queen Naomi and the uh, of Ife, even the six wives in the palace. He was just throwing a, a an advice, saying that for a marriage to be successful, you don't need to include the parents. It's not that you don't need to tell them anything that is happening or something, but to include them, for them to be uh, meddling inside, as in, for them to be uh, doing everything, knowing everything going on in the marriage or more, ha, it, it, it is not easy, so it's not good. So he also advised family of the king and his wife to meddle too much in the embattled marriage, saying too much involvement of relations might cause disrespect, okay? So he's saying that too much involvement in it might cause disrespect, and that is actually the truth, okay? When uh, the everybody put their mouth, all the family members start to, start to put their mouth inside this particular uh, saga now, inside them, if you see that uh, there will be a disrespect, is either the people of Akure disrespect only of Ife or the people of uh, Ile Ife disrespect the people of Akure, okay? So that is what is happening, almost happening right now. Let me not say that it is happening already, but uh, that is what is, is in fact, that is where they are heading to now if care is not taken. So this man has advised that only of Ife should consult the oracle before getting married to any wife, that he shouldn't just reach out to a woman and tell him, oh, the God has directed me to choose you, uh, that uh, the person will now become your wife. No, that it is not enough, that they should consult the Efa priest to consult the oracle and once the oracle is consulted then they should take exercise patience let them not just jump boom into the marriage that they should exercise patience okay so he also advised everybody in Ilefe saying that if you want to get married to a wife don't just rush into it don't just say oh my god i've told me oh i saw in my dream oh they saw that you had the sugar in my tea and everything that they need to consult the Efa priest they consult the oracle for them to know if the person they're trying to settle down with is actually the right person for them, okay? So that they shouldn't allow modernity to detect who to marry. Yeah, that is okay, okay? That is, I think that is a good idea, okay? That is a good advice to the throne of Ilefe kingdom okay so he advised that only of if you should take it gently where women matter day okay that if that is not taken care of that <laughs> a leo that so many others so many things will still happen that is the wise living the palace might still occur but because these ones the, if they leave the palace it will be on for their own shame or something like that that is the reason why they are still there and enduring everything that is not that they still want to stay there that they are tired of staying in the palace of Ilefe kingdom they are tired of the whole saga because right now only of Ife has been planning seriously planning to bring Queen Naomi Shilekunola back to the palace of Ilefe kingdom and when you look at it you know so well that uh uh Queen Naomi uh, was um the right one chosen f uh, by uh, um a far priest yeah so the Efa priest chose her, her. They consulted the oracle, and the Queen Naomi Shilekunola was chosen. Okay, so 
that is the reason why maybe only Ofife has uh, seen that he made mistake with the sex wife. So that is the reason why he has been doing everything possible to make sure that Queen Naomi gets back to the palace with his with her son. Uh, recall that uh, an Ifa priest revealed also that the son can grow up anywhere anywhere that is not a must that he can that he will uh, that they will train and bring him up in the palace that so far his father approved of him staying outside the palace that's hmm nothing is going wrong that queen naomi can be a uh, is a good mother to him okay so guys let me know your opinion about all this about this uh, elder uh, elder's uh, advice let me know your opinion about it under the comment section and i'll be glad about it okay in case if you haven't subscribed please do so now give this video a massive thumbs up share to your family and friends okay and uh, drop your opinion under the comment section without insulting anybody um i will see you all in my next video bye for now thank you and god bless you